Volunteers are pouring into Moore, Oklahoma, looking for ways to help. Many of them are church members who walk through the neighborhoods asking what they can do, how they can help. Nine on your side reporter Jay Warren is live and more with a look at how the disaster has brought strangers together for a common good. Jay? It has indeed, Clyde. The folks here and more, of course, have needed so much help this week and additionally today because torrents of rain came into the area early this morning, causing flash flooding and soaking property in some cases that many people had hoped they would be able to salvage uh, later this week. Now, we caught up with a pastor, a pastor Shane Kendricks from Mundy, Texas, with a few members of his church. Kendricks and others would simply walk the streets here, asking if they could help with salvage or in, in some cases prayer. Now, one family had to hope to reclaim property, but that was spare, uh, dashed when rain took that hope away. Kendrick says that whatever he and his group can provide, including just a hug, he will do. We should be giving back to those that, that, that need the help the most. And, and these people here and more, I mean, as you can see, I mean, there's just nothing left. Yeah. And, uh, and they just need all the help they can get. And uh, it's, it's Americans helping Americans. Now you're looking at a live picture of power crews trying to get some work done here and get the power back up to more reconnecting. Uh, a lot of these posts were put in uh, the day before yesterday and today, and now they're trying to connect the wires before they activate power. Uh, again, rain three to four inches in the course of two hours. Also about 30 miles east of here, a town of Shawnee hit by a tornado on Sunday. They've seen relatively little assistance compared to what Moore has seen since Monday. So those folks needing help too. Jay Warren in Moore, Oklahoma, 9 on your side. Thank you, Jay. More local news now.